It was a rowdy situation at Ohen Ward, Ovia Northeast Local Government Area, where a large crowd of people turned out for the registration exercise. Two police officers at the center who spoke off camera said they were almost overpowered by the crowd as they made attempt to rough handle the core members deployed by INEC for the exercise. The reinforcement of police officers from Okada Police Division led to the arrest of a young man alleged to have attempted to snatch the data capturing machine. <laughs> Some eligible voters, however, claimed that the three capturing machines sent to the center, which comprises about seven communities, were inadequate. The card is much. The card is much, and the machine is not working well. Everybody, every, everybody started pushing one or another. They want to be captured automatically. You see, there's a little problem going on here and there. But the issue is from our neck in the beginning. The place was not properly arranged. One machine for five tons that have population up to seven tons, up to about uh, 500 lining up on this field. At the time they brought in the third machine, the crowd was overwhelming. And there was scuffle here and there. The policemen later rescued the three core members and took away two of the machines for security reasons, with one machine left behind for the exercise. At Ikaladeran Primary School, Okada, eligible voters turned out in a large number to be registered. Though the exercise went on peacefully, voters complained that the registration was slow and called on INEC to send more machines. Okay, this morning till now, they now have to up to, up to 20, up to 30. It's bad now. So now that will be the real problem. See everybody for so since morning till now. Be with my children, get inside the car. They're not seeing phone. Now this afternoon they can't give us one. Feel now, they're not, they never answer us for you. I tell you. It was, however, gathered that two machines were originally assigned to the center, and that one has just been added. Pius Nsogo reporting.